Good afternoon, good evening, this is John Paul Wright. I'm coming to you from Tokyo, Japan. Today, I'm going to be taking a shot at the Captain Marvel box office. It's coming up, why not? But first, I want to go through a little brief history of what some other movies did in the box office to kind of give me an idea of what I could kind of take a guess at. So, the big one that I'm going to compare to is Solo. I mean, we have a similar situation with Solo where now Brie Larson said all this stuff about white dudes and things like that. And she just stirred up the media in a negative way. And there's a lot of people who are boycotting it in the same way Solo got boycotted. Where you had The Last Jedi. People were kind of pissed at what happened with the characters. Things like that. Seems very similar. Solo did 1, 1, 4.2. Or should I say 114 million in the box office. Just about according to Fader.com. And Aquaman did 72.7 million in the box office. By the way, opening weekend. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Opening weekend here. Solo did 114 million opening weekend. Very important fact I forgot, but we got the fact and we're moving forward. Alita did 28.5 million according to Box Office Mojo. Infinity Wars, I think has the record, 542 million opening weekend according to Entertainment and Arts. Force Awakens, 528 million, not bad, not bad. And uh, Captain America Civil War, 379.5 million. And Suicide Squad and Deadpool were pretty much tied up around 265 million. I think it was actually 264, 263, something like that. But they're really close. One of my favorites, Logan, did 247 million. So when you just kind of take a look at these popular movies, kind of superhero movies, kind of similar type of movies, things in that. And of course, Solo being the biggest comparison. It's tough. I mean, is Captain Marvel going to make more than Solo? Hmm, I don't know. I'm gonna say no. I think Captain Marvel is not gonna make more than Solo on opening weekend. I also think it's not gonna break 100 million. And by the way, I saw some other people release videos on this. I haven't even taken a look. I saw John Talks had a video on this, and I didn't get far enough into the video until I realized I gotta make my own, so I don't know what John's prediction is. And I'm just taking a real guess here, because I'm so bad at this stuff, but I wanted to do it, and I'm gonna guess somewhere between 60 and 75 let's just say that i'm not going to call an exact number i have no idea but i'd be surprised if captain marvel breaks 100 i hope it does like 10 million i hope it does like zero but like realistically i hope it does like 10 15 million i hope the screen just melts when you know the movie just starts actually but realistically there are some people who want to see it so I'm gonna hope it goes for like 20 million. Wait, I said 10. I'm being easy on her now. Alright. I hope it does zero. Just let's say that. But I think it'll probably do around 60 to 75. And hopefully after that, you know, the word will get out that it's a cardboard cutout mo movie. It's very bland. Bree's acting's terrible. And no one's gonna see it the second weekend. And that'd be nice. Anyway, if you disagree with me, that's cool. You know, sorry to say, but I hope the movie bombs. And if you do agree with me... Let me know what you think the box office prediction will be down in the comments. Leave a number, leave a comment, leave whatever you want. As long as you're not telling me I'm fat, ugly, stupid, something like that. I'll leave the comments up there. And, uh, yeah, that's it. I do shoutouts, special thanks, got a patron, got a Twitter. Gonna link all this stuff down below if I remember. And I will see you next time.